Good morning. God bless you this morning. It's good to have you here. I'm Matthew. God bless you today and keep you alive. God bless your family and protect them. May his hand of safety be upon you. Now and always. Your day is blessed. And something new is springing up in your life. The Lord does a new thing. And you will partake in it. This morning, God has set a table before you. For your life and family. He has made something to kickstart your day. I believe that the Lord will give you grace for today. I am excited because I know. You are not alive today because of your power or might. You are alive. Because you have a God that loves you unconditionally. And his mercies are new every morning. The Lord has blessed you today. His mercies are speaking for you and your household. God is intentional about your day. God is intentional about your family. God is intentional about your life. This morning, I want you to make a strong confession of faith. In the comment section below. The Lord is my delight this day. God is doing something new. I want you to write your first name and this faith sentence attached to it. Everything around you experiences something new. Your business. Your family. Your academics. Your marriage. Your life. As the day breaks. So does every chain surrounding your life. There is newness within every aspect of your life. I believe that old things have passed away. And all things have become new. Every part of your body that has been worn out. By sickness. Or infirmities. Is renewed. I want you to see today. As a new chapter. And a new encounter with God's blessings. Before we get into the prayers. I want you to like this video. When you like this video. You are letting YouTube know. That you like what you are hearing and seeing. And it can recommend to others. If you are new here. You are welcome to this channel. From now. I am adopting you into my prayer circle. And I will be praying for your life. And family daily. All you have to do. Is to stay connected. By hitting the subscribe button. In red letter. And hit the notification bell. So that YouTube reminds you. When I drop any of the prayers. God places in my heart for you. Jesus admonishes us to ask. To ask daily in Matthew 6. After this prayer. You will feel renewed and anointed. You will feel assured of God's care for your life. Psalm 19 verse 14 says. Let the words of my mouth. And the meditation of my heart. Be acceptable in your sight. O Lord. My rock and my redeemer. Help me Lord. To remember the promises of your word. And bring the right passage to my remembrance for the situation. Remove fear and anxiety. From my life dear Lord. You said in your word. 2 Timothy 1 verse 7. That you have not given me a spirit of fear. But of love. Power. And a sound mind. When I am fearful. May I remember your love for me. And rest in your assurance. May I tap into the power. That you have given me. May your wisdom be the underpinnings. For my sound mind. Lord. I ask that you keep me. And my family in perfect peace. Because our minds have stayed on you. Lord. Today I cast my burdens. I throw them at your feet. I take up my cross for today. And follow you. I trust you to help me today sweet Holy Spirit. I pray that you take charge of my life. And work it out for my good. I know the thoughts you have toward me are thoughts of peace and not of evil. Lord. I trust your plans for my life. I trust that you are working in and through my life. To make me for your use. I pray that you make me a practical instrument. For you to reconcile nations. And families to you. I pray that today is a day full of favors. I have favor with men. And anyone that looks at me. Will be caused to favor me. I pray that I walk in the light of God. Lord Jesus. Continually set me on fire. That I would burn till the very end. Cause me to be a light to the nations. May I be a blessing to all those. That I come in contact with today. And beyond. I confess that my help comes from Yahweh. Who made heaven and earth. You will not allow my foot to be moved. You who keep me will not slumber. Behold. 
You who keeps Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. Yahweh is my keeper. Yahweh is my shade on my right hand. The sun will not harm me by day, nor the moon by night. Yahweh will keep me from all evil. He will keep my soul. You O Lord, will keep my going out and my coming in. From this time forth, and forevermore. Thank you Jesus for your mercies. May your name be highly exalted. Thank you Jesus for answering my prayers. For in Jesus mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. I want you to type a big Amen. In the comment section below. Claiming every prayer for your life and family. God bless you all for joining in. To pray this morning. Before we go for today. I want you to share this video. With others. If this video is a blessing. Then bless someone else with this too. Every time you share any of these videos. You are multiplying blessings for yourself. And your family. I also want you to share. What God has done for you. With three persons today. Thank you as you do that. Remain fervent in prayers. And continue meditating on these scriptures. Until you receive my next prayer for you. As we pray. I believe the Lord can hear you. Psalm 5 verse 3 says. In the morning O Lord. I will direct my song and my prayer unto you. And will look up. Repeat these words after me. O Lord. I thank you for this day. That you have made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I thank you for preserving my life. For one more day and sustaining me. Holy Spirit. I thank you for your ultimate gift of love to me. And my family. I thank you for the life you have given me. In your Son. Christ Jesus. Because of this overwhelming gift of life. That I cannot comprehend. I humbly submit it to you. I know Lord. That I am a mere human. And cannot instruct you. But you Lord can instruct me. So teach me your ways. That I may rely on your path. Teach me to number my days. And to use my time wisely. Bringing glory to your name. I may not know what today holds. But I know that you hold today. It was you that laid the foundations of the earth. And therefore understand every part of it. I know that you keep the sun in the sky. And the stars in place. And have created this earth for me. To dominate and rule over. Throughout this day. May I be keenly aware of your presence in everything I do. As I go about my daily activities. Working and resting. May my life be a living example. For others to see you in me. May you position me for impact today Lord. May I minister life. Peace. And hope. To those around me. May my words be seasoned with salt. And minister grace to all that here. May my actions be aligned with your word. And may I be led by your spirit. I pray for peaceable wisdom. Gentle. And approachable. With lots of mercy and fairness. You said in the book of James. That an unlimited supply of wisdom. Is available to me. If I simply ask. So I pray for wisdom. To know how to deal with the many people. And situations that will cross my path. I pray for protection throughout this day. Protect me from harm and evil. Go before me. To the left and right of me. And behind me. Order my steps. So that I walk worthy of your calling throughout this day. That I may be in tune with your prompting. Whether it shows up as a gentle tug. Or a strong conviction. Lord. You know my faults and my flaws. Forgive me for being unkind with my words. And my thoughts. Forgive me for being self-serving. Forgive me for holding on to old wounds. Instead of giving them to you. Forgive me Lord. For all my sins. When I am overwhelmed. Confused. Unsure. And restless. Help me run to your word.